Okay, morning guys. Happy Friday. I just got up. Well, not just got up. I've been logged into work since uh, 7 o'clock. Today is Friday. I am um, about to run and take my son to work. Well, I'm going to be a passenger. He is going to drive himself to work. Um... And then I'm gonna come back. It's right, it's literally like right around the corner. So I'm gonna do that. And where is my license? Let me just find my license, guys. He has to be to work at 8.30. I just jumped up. Hold on, guys, I gotta get my license, hold on. So we have that. I literally just wash my face, brush my teeth. Um, I will make up my bed when I come back. Let me go do that. Ready, pops? Okay. I will. All right. So. I'm gonna run him to work real quick. go start the car okay guys so i am in the car waiting for my son and i jumped in the passenger seat because he will be um <laughs> driving himself to work it's humid out here already guys let me see what the weather's supposed to be today oh my god 95 degrees today that sounds like a pool day to me Oh my goodness. And you could feel the humidity. Um, yesterday, guys, was insanely brutal. Like, I called myself, I went to the um went into the office yesterday, right? And I wore my David Yerman bracelets. So I called myself walking to David Yerman to get my bracelets clean. I made it to Nordstrom, which is literally like on the corner. I looked around on the first floor and left and went right back into work i was dripping sweat i was like negative those bracelets will will have to wait let me put my seat belt on y'all okay guys so i'm back from dropping my son off um, answering some work uh emails um let me open my blinds guys when i wake up in the morning i have got to open up my blinds my curtains everything i need that um sunshine daylight i need it all so yeah can i just show you guys oh it got dark i'm sorry can i just show you guys my plant i am going today to get some soil and i am going to cut this plant and pot it let me just show you guys Do you guys see this? It is actually leaning over now. Like, it's just like, just look at it. It's like all the way <laughs> to the ceiling. I feel so bad. And remember my fiddle leaf guys that wasn't doing too well? This is her right here. She's growing, but I have to, she likes the sun, but not too much of it. Cause as you can see, there's some uh, burnt leaves um, and then you can see the sunspots on her so I have to figure uh oh I'm losing these I have to figure it out but um yeah what is it yeah two of them yeah she's definitely definitely burning I need to move her like ASAP so I'm gonna do this today guys and I will um let me put her in here for a second. I will let you guys see um, the process. Yeah, she's losing way too many leaves. The soil, the soil is dry too. Let me um, let me. Well, you know what? I'm not gonna water her because it's gonna make the pot heavier when I try to move it. So. But yeah, she has a lot of 
me and she has some new ones coming up guys as you can see but they're coming up burnt so yeah i gotta i gotta move this guys definitely have to move her out the way um i'll probably try to put her like right here somewhere i just need another stand but then i'm afraid that she's not gonna get well you know what i'll put her right here for the time being I do have another stand. I'm going to just um, grab it and put her here and then I will water her. But this one's growing really nice as well. Love, love, love this. Some new babies coming in. She likes this spot. I have to repot this one too because she's really heavy. So... I just have some repotting to do, guys. This one's growing good, too. This one loves water. I have to... Um, I don't know how to repot this one. I don't know if I have to repot this one, guys. I have to see from the um, nursery where I, where I um, purchased this. They pretty, they're pretty good with helping me. Like I'll send them pictures and stuff. And they'll um, advise me on what to do. But it looks like this one is leaning toward the sun. Like it's trying to get some sunlight. Um, yeah, I get really, really good sunlight here. I don't know who pulled this back. But I need to open this some more. So nothing is blocking. So everything's coming through. So yeah, my husband's like, oh my God, it's so many plants. I'm like, babe, it's not. We have one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. I have five big plants and they just look like a lot, but it's really not. I promise you guys it's not. One, two, three, that fiddle leaf fig. The big fiddle leaf fig, that's four. And then I have the monstera, that's five. No, this is not a monstera. I forgot the name of this plant. Um, dang it, I forgot the name of this plant. The monstera is behind it. So here's my monstera back here. And this one needs to be repotted as well because the roots are coming out. So, and then I have my um, good luck uh, plant back there. I need to water her as well. So yeah, let me... Um, finish working guys and I will jump back on when I um, get the soil and start with the plants oh before I go um, so I need to go do my nails today they have really grown out and I hate long nails guys I don't like when I'm typing on my keyboard and I can hear the clicking it drives me crazy and that's when I know they are too long I also want to get my hair cut down a little bit I have not been able to get to Brooklyn to get... Let me find some light, guys. Is this good? Let's see. Find the light. Let's set. Find the light. Um, okay, this is good. Um, I have not been able to get to Brooklyn to get my hair cut. I have had so much going on. Um, I was supposed to go right before I went to Miami for the wedding. But um, I had a toothache and I had to get a um what do you call it a filling filled and messed around and waited too long so it then turned into needing a root canal so i was like okay root canal over here cut where's your priority so definitely <laughs> the root canal came so i had to cancel my appointment last minute um and i have not found or had any time to go and get my hair cut so i'm gonna try this place up here by me that um, a lot of, or well, a few of the pixie girls on Instagram, and, well, the one who mentioned it first, her name is uh, Jolanda. I'm not sure if you guys follow her on Instagram. She is bomb.com. Absolutely love her. So she just recently went to a salon called um, Something Cuts. I can't remember. I'll put it right here on the screen. Something Cuts. And she went and just got a point cut. And she said she paid $18 and they just, you know, kind of point cut, cleaned her up or whatever. And she went home and styled it herself. So I did find one up here um, where I live. So I'm going to try them. And a good thing is they're right in the shopping center where I get my nails done. So that's like good because I could just like go to one place right across the street to the next place. I don't have to drive far. It's literally right there. So I'm going to try them today. 
um, since I do have like my base cut I just need them to clean up so I'm gonna try that today guys so fingers crossed <laughs> that it works out um, and then see if I can get an appointment for these nails and that is pretty much all I have to do today I have to run some errands I need to run to Target I have not been to Target in a while guys I'm trying to stay out of these places um, I'm trying to be strong and not shop. There's really nothing that I need, but me, I'll go in there and make an excuse to get something and like, oh, I need this or I don't have this. I have to stop that. So I have been avoiding the stores. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm going to do that and I think that's going to be it today. But in any event, I will bring you guys along with me on my Friday. So see you guys soon. Okay guys, so I am all showered. I just threw on this little um, dress here. Hold on, let me turn you guys around. So I just put this little dress on. I think it's from H&M. Um, I need to find a bra, guys, where I can remove the straps because I hate, I think it's so tacky when you can see the straps like, you know, um, underneath your clothes. I just, yeah, it's just not cool. Um, but it is what it is for right now. I'm just running in my neighborhood. I was going to wait until like six o'clock and get my hair done, but I think I'm going to go ahead and just go and let them cut it now. Um, and then just head back and get my nails done. Um, yeah, I haven't had a cut in a while guys. I have all these little long edges here and it's just not, yeah, it's just not doing what it's supposed to do guys. Look at this sticking up so i'm gonna go ahead and get that done now i'm gonna take my um <clears throat> i'm gonna take anaya with me if you guys are new here anaya is my stepdaughter i call her my bonus daughter um so i'm gonna go ahead and take her with me so that she can vlog it so you guys can see hopefully they allow me to um vlog um yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and do that and then I'm going to run to, I just realized I had a credit from Walmart. So I'm going to go there and get me some body wash, which saves me because I don't have to go inside Target. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> um, yeah, let me run and do that and I'll bring you guys along with me. All right, let me get my stuff together. Later. Okay, guys, so before I head out, um, I was putting on my jewelry and realized that it was disgustingly dirty. And I had to wait for my uh stepdaughter anyway to finish eating so i was like you know what let me go ahead and clean my jewelry real quick so just wanted to share with you guys what i did so i put it in a bowl i think i shared it with you guys before i put it in a bowl and i placed aluminum foil in the bowl put all the jewelry inside and i covered the jewelry with baking soda i added a little dawn um dish detergent this time and then i put boiling hot water it was so dirty and look at my David Yerman bracelets, guys. I should have kind of did a before and after, but oh my God, they are so beautiful because they were horrible. And then here is my uh, favorite Judith Ripka bracelet. I love this. You guys see all these stones on here? So, so, so beautiful. So I'm just cleaning it now, rinsing it and laying it out here real quick. I didn't want to, I usually soak it for a while, but I didn't want to do that this time because I did clean my wedding ring um, as well, which I am going to wear. So let me just finish rinsing and um, <clears throat> cleaning that. And showing you guys how it all looks. Get it bouncing. Yeah. Okay guys, so everything is nice and clean, as you can see. These came really, really clean. My Yermans. I forgot who these bracelets are by, guys, but I have had these bracelets at least 15 years. At least. As you can see, I'm missing um, the closure here on the bottom you see the difference we have the closure on this one Hold on. right here 
so I'm missing that but it is okay then I have my Judith Ripka stackable rings love these I'm gonna actually wear these today my wedding ring this is Joan Boyce um, initial L love this bracelet I might put that on today as well um, my Judith Ripka ring here Judith Ripka love ring love bracelet here I think this is Judith Ripka too I'm not sure and then this is just from one of my friends that sells jewelry and it's just an anklet so I'm gonna put this on now as well and the rest of the stuff I'll just leave it here to dry and then I'll put them back in um, their bags so yep all right guys let me throw this on and this time for sure I'm gonna head out head out of the house okay bye. okay guys so I am finally out of the house let me open up this window so I can give y'all some light there we go much better so I'm finally out of the house I'm gonna stop at the bank my stepdaughter's behind me because she's just gonna record for you guys and then she's gonna head to the gym I'm like girl you are dedicated I cannot work out in a thousand degrees absolutely not um, so yeah I'm gonna stop at the bank grab some cash run and well not run <laughs> but go and get oh let me turn this damn music down um get some cash go and get my hair cut um and then come back home what was i doing when i left home i was doing some laundry i had like two two little two small loads of clothes and that was basically about it so i'm gonna go home and just chill out until my nail appointment at six o'clock so yeah I will um, see you guys if they let me record I'll see you guys inside um, y'all again fingers crossed all right bye okay guys so I am here let's go wish me luck go to the gym once I start he's gonna let him start. so for the back here yep. you want me to just Kind of clean this up with the trimmers here off the back of your neck right but don't edge it up perfectly so i don't line it up perfectly i'm sorry i just kind of okay and you like this coming forward a little bit right there oh, or yeah. um do yes. you work back um forward is fine that's fine. okay
I can't tell how the cut came out until I actually wet it and wash it and then I can see um, how the cut is so I will let you guys know once I wet it and wash it but my hair feels lighter it's not as heavy thank goodness and for a quick cleanup I think it's okay but again I won't be able to tell you guys fully until I um, wash it so stay tuned hey guys so I decided decided <laughs> I decided to come to my pool in my complex because it is like a million degrees outside right now so that's what I'm doing I'm here with my bonus daughter she has no interest of getting in the water she just wants to read her book which is fine that is fine y'all but I had to get in that water had to I have a 5 30 nail excuse me six o'clock nail appointment i cannot wait because these things are claws to me and um that's basically that y'all it's about four or five kids in this pool and i swear they sound like it's about 12. <laughs> so yeah i'm gonna actually sit here until about five 35 45 and then head to get um my nails done so i will see you guys at the nail salon Bye. okay y'all so i am all finished at the nail salon that took forever me who is this on my glasses me wanting something all fancy y'all i was exhausted i was ready to tell her listen just paint it regular so this is what I have. I thought this was very, very pretty. So she had to do both, all these colors. I know she she always be sick of me. She be like, Lisette, we don't do fancy stuff in here. I'm like, Hannah, you got this. You could do it, Hannah, you could do it. <laughs> she be sick of me. But in any event, y'all, I'm tired. I'm getting ready to get something to eat. I'm gonna go home, take a shower. I gotta wash this chlorine out of my hair. Ugh. And I'm going to lay it down. It's 7.20. So, yeah, it's about to be my bedtime. So, I will. You know what? I'm going to stop at Chipotle, y'all, and get me a salad real quick. Real quick and tense. So, let me do this. Uh oh, is Chipotle even open? Say they still open. Say they still open. They are still open, y'all. Let me run in here and get this salad. And I will see you guys when I get home. All right, later.